Hello everyone, this is Ninshi again. So this video is about improving intellectual ability. Intellectual ability refers to your capability to do mental activities and today's competitive world, whether you talk about studies or work or no matter what country you're in, it's very important to have good intellectual ability. So this in this video, I'll talk about five dimensions of intellectual ability and how you can improve these. So the first type of intellectual ability is memory. Nowadays, it's very important to remember like places, events, people, or their names. The best way to improve on your memory about something is to keep repeating it to yourself. Say it out loud, repeat it five times, or write it down and you're less likely to forget something. The second type of intellectual ability is verbal comprehension. This refers to your ability to understand what you read or you hear. The best and fun way to improve this is by being fluent at the language that you're communicating in. And you can do this by watching movies in that language or reading books. So you're familiar with how sentences are structured and you will be better at verbal comprehension. The third dimension of intellectual ability is perceptual speed. Perceptual speed means when you hear something or you have, you can easily and quickly spot the differences or similarities between two things. This is very important in decision making. Perceptual speed can be improved by simply playing video games or even teamwork, like team games. When you have outdoor activities and teams or team sports, this helps develop your perceptual speed. The fourth dimension of intellectual ability is inductive reasoning. What is inductive reasoning? It's similar to forecasting. It's like using a sequence to come up with the solution to a problem. Inductive reasoning can be improved by taking these psychometric inductive reasoning tests online. They will greatly improve. They will allow you to follow a sequence and to find a solution using that sequence. And the final dimension of intellectual ability is called deductive reasoning. Deductive reasoning is all about using logic or generalizations to assess a situation. The two best ways to be good at deductive reasoning is to be very knowledgeable about the choice that you have to make, to know everything from all sides, from all aspects, so that it becomes easier for you to choose between two things. And the other, of course, best way is to be observant, to observe a case or a situation greatly and to study it well will allow you to better make decisions about it.